All right, guys, so in this video, we're gonna go ahead and create the next section, which is the photography section. Very simple again, very straightforward, but the only thing to note here is that this image um, is going to have a height of 420 pixels. Now that is something that I have defined. You can go with any number that you want. And the way this is gonna work is that when I, when I tap on any of the particular tabs, um, it's going to open up, uh, you know, that particular tab section where I can see the content inside of it, right? And this is pretty much what we're gonna do. It's very simple and straightforward. So uh, let's get started. So I'm gonna start off by grabbing these two texts, which is, I'm gonna copy this, and um, I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, you know, increase this and paste it over here, okay? And we're gonna turn on the grids, right? And uh, make sure that this is, again, 120 pixels from the top, Perfect. And what we're gonna do next is select this and say, this, this is gonna be photography and uh, just say photography. This is gonna be the text that we have and I'm gonna go ahead and paste it, right? And um, we're gonna make sure that uh, the distance between these two is pretty much the same where we're using everywhere is 24. So I set this to 24 and also kind of move this so that it's 120 pixels from the top, right? Pretty cool. Um, the next thing is we're gonna create these tabs. Now, to create these tabs is super simple. What I'm gonna do is grab the button that we had created before, right? I'm gonna copy this, all right? And I'm gonna go ahead and paste it over here. And then I'm gonna go and set the width of this, the horizontal padding to 16 and the vertical padding to be 12, right? And uh, then we're gonna go Italy, Australia, India, and Brazil. So I'm gonna say Italy, all right? And then we can duplicate this and say Australia and then we can say India and then we can say Brazil right cool now we're gonna select all this and we can put them into an auto layout itself so we can go ahead and put these into an auto layout and now we can go ahead and play around with the spacing. We can probably set it to 24 um, because I think 24 is a good number, all right? And Italy is the one that's gonna be the selected tab. So I'm just gonna go ahead and add a fill of purple. So this is pretty much how it's gonna look. And we want this to be 40 pixels uh, down or I'm not quite sure what number we used over here, but okay, it was 64. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, set this to be 64. And there we go, that's super simple. Pretty quickly, we can go ahead and finish this up. Nothing much to it. So make sure this is an auto layout. If you wanna add another one, you can just copy paste and that goes inside. And let's say you wanna delete one, it's gonna auto layout itself and that's pretty cool. Great, so the next one is to add these images. Now, I'm just gonna copy these images. They are very straightforward and I'm gonna paste it over here. And uh, I think the distance we want is around 40 pixels. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, so this to like 40 pixels and all these are aligning to the grid itself it's perfect and what i'm going to do is i'm just going to go ahead and grab this information and i'm going to bring this down like so and i'm going to say photography and i'm going to say image height is 420 pixels right there we go right and this that looks pretty good and that's pretty much it guys, like there's nothing really complicated. We're gonna go select all this and right click and choose a frame selection and hold Alt and Control and Option to uh, move it, to scale it sideways and we can move it up here as well. There we go. And uh, 120 pixels and yeah, this looks perfect, right? So that's pretty much it for this section. And in the next section, we're gonna go ahead and create the form section, which is over here. So I will see you guys in the next video.